Here is lot two, four dash one crossbred male. Uh, he is a shame on me out of all, an all day sow. Uh, that all day sow is just one of the biggest legged animals uh, we've got here. Um, and, and she has uh, made unique offspring every time and this this one here is is no exception to that and, and he's out of shame on me which is a boar that i was excited to use last um, which one is this four dash one four one okay that that i was excited to use last uh last fall um shame on me i thought was one that combined as many extras as you could and, and still staying correct and i think this this male prospect certainly uh is is kind of what i expected out of that Really like this pig. Uh, he's got that style and pizzazz that you want when you're hitting the show ring and, and when you come through the gate. I really appreciate that about him. I like his skull, but he's got that extension up front. Uh, he's got the shame on me skull, but he's got that extension underneath there right. and, and gives you that look. You like his color pattern, but then you get up on top of him. You talk about one that's got blade, big old blade working in him. He's very sound and athletic out here. You get behind this guy, he's got a really big, thick kind leg to him, super flexible, uses it correctly. One that really puts a lot of unique pieces together that are hard to do, yet still covers all the bases in terms of skeleton build, in terms of having good feet and legs. Really outstanding individual here, Chad. Right, and I think this this is the type that, uh, you know, when you're in the nursery looking at pigs and you think, gosh, is this guy going to be too much? And, and since he's come out, um, into, into the show barn. He's done all the right things. Uh, he's, he's grown uh, upward, which, which he probably needed to do a little bit. And like Ben said, he is really stout about his skull, but he's still tight about his throat and clean about his throat and long about his front end. And, um, yeah, you can work a long time to try to make one like this, and they can be uh, really stout from blade to back, but then too stout when you get to their blade forward. I think this one com combines being able to be stout with the right kind of look and chest and, um, one that I'm certainly proud of. Again, that would be lot two, 4-1, crossbred male.